Open her spiritual intellect, oh God, and feel it, oh God. Give her the strength, glory to God, the ability, glory to God, to carry out the spiritual function that you have called us, God, that you have called her to do. Glory to God, and as she minister unto us, God, give us a receptive heart. In the name of Jesus, we break every diabolical forces, every demonic order that stand against preaching, that stand against the word of God. Let it break now in the name of Jesus and let the word of God flow like oil in the house now. Let it be so now in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. 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 Receive. Amen. Our night speaker. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Amen. I don't call her by her surname because, amen, two times she she have knock me and me have list tongue when I get long words. When I heard long with tongue list and when I can't pronounce it good, so, amen, my one is not, my one is, is, is a list tongue and her one is knock me. So I don't call her surname because I don't want to call it wrong because she said we do her injustice if we don't call it correct. But I will not get sister. I will not get Pastor Sharon wrong. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You want my mic? Do we have a praise in the house today? Hallelujah! Because everyone has a praise tonight. Hallelujah! Has God been good to anybody this week? Hallelujah! Blessed be the name of Jesus. Lift your hand and give the Lord a praise tonight. Hallelujah! Oh man, look at that man. Give the Lord a praise. Somebody shout Hallelujah. glory in the Hallelujah. Hallelujah.
name of Jesus. I want to have much time tonight. So you better take it and get it. Bless them in the name of Jesus. Somebody shout out glory in the house.
Are you hearing me? Make sure you make more mind because my voice is so good. When convention done, every week we say I'm strong. We have a church. What should I give the pastor that yet? So we preach, we preach 10, 9, 7, 1, 2, 3. So we said last night. When convention over, you must be the same person. Because we have some people now, church, church people these days, when they come to convention and crusade, a preacher they come to hear, and a God they come to see. You miss the mark. When you come to listen to the preacher, but you must focus upon God. As if I'm weak, may not touch nobody in here. Because someone will love the flat no preacher then. And then touch now and drop and mash up your head. That's why I smell your head sick, so. Man, sick head, no good. Alright, sit down. Say after me, I will not be moved. I will not be moved. By what I see. By what I see. But by what I know, but by what I, know I am clothed with strength, I am clothed with strength and, dignity. and dignity. I am valuable, I am valuable. Free. free, redeemed. redeemed. I, am forgiven. I am forgiven. Hello, I'm going to speak to your church. So like when we say I'm forgiven, I'm sure I'm here. I am forgiven. I am forgiven. Anointed, anointed and accepted. And accepted. I, am I am empowered to change my story. To change my story. I'm seen by God. I'm seen by God. I'm marked by God. I'm marked by God. I'm heard by God. I'm heard by God. And I'm favored by God. And I'm favored by God. I am his beloved. I am his beloved. So, so I will declare this. I am equipped for every good work that God has planned for me. I am anointed and empowered by the Almighty God. Every bondage, every bondage, every limitation, every limitation is broken off me. Is broken off me. This is my time to shine. This is my time to shine. Say it again. This is my time to shine. Say it like you believe it. This is my time to shine. I will rise higher. Wonderful bishop. I'm not sure he's on my right now. And I want to thank him for allowing me to be here. He was the one I met. Amen. Amen. Bless God. And from him to the from him to Minister Barber and then to Reverend Tugman, 
is when me come church me meet Pastor Spence. Hey, some people they want when you come to go to the yard, you feel the way them do. They wake up five o'clock, you wake up five too. That's time I see for some people here. Because when I go to work, you wake up five o'clock with them. So I sleep until I'm ready to get up. I'm going to tell us to listen. Don't think you're going to be treating me like whatever. Kill yourself with work. I make my own tea. Make the sandwich. Look after what I want. You want to understand? My uncle Jamaican girl, I'm going to come show up like this and I come from Timbuktu. So I'm not trouble all that kind of way then. I make myself comfortable. Amen? Amen. When you got people place you don't give them that trouble. Yes. Right now she don't even know what I don't eat. Mm. You think she present me God with really. As Christian, you must be flexible, Bishop. So I wanna thank you all. You have you have you have been treating me very well since I got here. Let's cut my ushers from the car. Sister Vans with my tea every night. And the rest, the rest are Uno. You have been so nice. Amen. Amen. And I say amen now. Amen. All of you have been nice. I get the smiles. Some men would have come and hug me at night time. One man said, You say, Woman, we love you so till. Let him see, let him see. Him. Let him see him. Let him see him. But he began sturdy. He said, me love you so tell. He said, what you say? He said, me love you so tell. He said, what you say? As a church must stay. Do not make people uncomfortable. Don't make people uncomfortable. Amen? Amen. Me have to beg one amen. amen. No make people uncomfortable. We must sound like we are talking now. Amen. Don't let me put aside my good English for you to respond to me. Alright? But I'm so happy being here. I listened to the voice of God. I accepted the invitation. And I'm not sorry that I'm here today. Amen. Somebody comes because I'm here. Yeah. You saw me special. Yeah. Yeah. All right, I have a friend, some friends over there, the couple, the Claytons. Can you stand? Let us see my wife. My daughter, son. Come on. My brother Scarlett is here tonight again from down my yard. Come on. Always. I you know I'm here because the grands are here, nobody can show them because the grand and they are. You understand? Yes, and there are others who might have known me. Last night when I was coming, a, a lady at the back said, Pastor, you and Courtney wife or sister. They said, Yes, ma'am. I know me like the fair. She here tonight? She sat over here with a baby last night. You know, you tonight. You uncle and wife and sister, me say yes, man. So me I tell Christians, say, if you are Christian, be Christian, be Christian. Yes. Yes. And who you know, you know. Yes. They become a liar and preach on some big platform. 300 people or more. So the children will really know me, but I won't even know five out of the children. So you must live good life, man. So I want to come and kill and you don't live at the airport. I like that. I left got a year put on you know, mixing up with my business. When you come, when you go to place, you must carry God with you. Amen. 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 Mr. Mabry, I miss it sometimes. Back over. I talk about it and some people very quiet, but Mr. Church people, be careful when you go to the immigration. Ask some question they ask you. Mm. What you tell them, say? Mm. Me don't, me not tell them. Mm. Mm. 
But some people still look for me like say they don't understand who they say. They tell me last night say you have one if I one reason you have to look for me, the one reason say me pretty. So you are correct. But you look at me otherwise than that, that may not welcome. Alright? God is good. Has anybody been empowered since Sunday morning? Can I see those persons who are here tonight who have given your life through this convention? Come up here. Come. Let, just walk up and come. Just walk up and come. Let the camera see you. Raise your hand and go up. Next, come. Next, come. Come. Come and get the back up. Come. While they're coming, clap them, clap them. Just raise your hand and sit down. Raise your hands, yeah, see the back twist. And this is just a part, a small part. La more a small part. That is here tonight. We have about four times this number. If all of them would have come to church, I'd be four times this number. I'm sure. God is good. I think I could stand up here for I come here to win a soul to God. Blessed be the name of Jesus. To win a soul to God. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Come on, somebody praise the Lord in the house. Keep the praises going. Keep the praises going. Hallelujah. Shout glory. Thank God for salvation. Now we have known the story of Ruth and Naomi. And cut a long story, shall we know that Naomi's husband died and the, the, the sons died and the two wives, Ruth and Arthur, they were left with a choice. Naomi said, listen, go back to where you come from. Don't follow me. They thought about it. The Bible said both girls cried. And the Bible says Orpah kissed the homie and went her way. And Ruth kept following or wanted to follow. The homie said, listen to me. You need to go back. Because even if I get pregnant now, by the time that son becomes a man that can marry to you. You will become an old woman. I'm in church. Stay with me. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Praise the name of the most high God. Praise the name of Jesus. And she would have said that to Ruth over and over. Turn back. Holy Spirit of God. I hope we have some root spirit in this house tonight. And that verse 16 in chapter 1 that we know from school years, uh, Ruth, look at me and say, listen to me, Naomi. Don't tell me to leave you. Don't tell me to stop falling after you. For wherever you go, I will go. We are the largest. Thy people. Thy God. Tell your neighbors, I'm mean, now I left church. Some people now working, man. I'm mean, now I left church. I don't care what you want. Tell me, I'm mean, now I left God. I'm mean, now leave the master. Entreat me not to leave thee or to return from falling after thee. The story went on. 
And they went, went to hey, glory. Hallelujah. Bethlehem. Jesus. And the people said, isn't that Nehomi? She said, don't call me Nehomi. Call me Mara. For the Lord hath dared very bitterly with me. And no one would have remembered a near kinsman of Elimelech yes. and the near name of Boaz. Jesus. And she would have spoken to Ruth and tell her about that near kinsman. The Bible said, Naomi advised Ruth. Yes. <laughs> and I'm going to cut long story short. You know, she gleaned in the field, right? She gleaned and when, when, when Boaz came and said, who is this young man? The woman and Boaz said, you know what? Drop some more wheat than will be normally dropped. So she can't get to when she's going home in the evening. Because Naomi, Ruth wanted to help Naomi, her mother-in-law. But if I jump over into chapter 3, where Naomi would have advised Ruth how to get to Boaz, and the Bible said, at the verse 3 specifically, that Naomi said to Ruth, Come on, dress yourself. Yes. Put on good clothes. Yes. Am I talking in a women's convention? Yes. Dress yourself. Yes. Put on some nice clothes. Yes. When you get down beyond the threshing floor, yes. I can't listen to that. The threshing floor. Yes. We're talking about empowerment. And for you to be empowerment, you have to get on God's threshing floor. You have a church to talk to tonight. Bless them in the name of Jesus. When you're on God's threshing floor, the wheat on the threshing floor is being beaten with some heavy something. And when they beat it and beat it, they throw it up. Oh, the spirit of a night God. They throw it up and the wind gets up here. And the wind blow away the shop. And the wind drop back down from church in the floor. Do you have a church to talk to tonight? Bless them in the name of Jesus. If you want to be empowered, you're going to stay on the threshing floor of the Almighty God. Somebody praise him in the house. Somebody praise him in the house. We have some people who want to go up on the threshing floor. Because when we to preach them backs, yes. you must tell me about you must take word. Yes. And I hear someone I'm talking about, you must still not talk. You look where you want to talk, and you can't talk. But you never say, take word. to all that her mother-in-law tell her to do. And I love Ruth, a woman of character. Yes. Yes. She dressed herself. Yes. She do what? Dress herself. She did what? Dress herself. You sure is that what she do? Yes. Also was sewing breast, leg, and tie. Yes. Now me not no more friend tonight when convention over. All my friends them gone. But who never show no breast, leg and tie. You can cover your titty. We shall three piece me your order. Breast, leg and tie. We have touch everything because we soon done and we soon done we hard. Women must be covered. Cover yourself. Cover yourself. You should come here and come preach so hard for your lucky. Your lucky. Your lucky semi by source. Bless them in the name of Jesus. Cover yourself. I feel like a draw back. I'm going to send it back to you. Come on yourself. Let me say I must go. Come on yourself. I sometimes you want to talk about the woman then. But man, 
Come on, 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 And some other man must wear big trousers. Come yeah, on, have a problem on this woman. Yeah. Interpret that. Yeah. I might be rude and speak, but it's according to knowledge. You don't understand what things are going on in a church. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, look over here, sir. And this is his family. So Ruth went down to the floor and she did. Now, Mr. When you when, when you go down there, it was a eat, not trouble. Him. Oh, the spirit of Almighty God. Somebody praise him in the house. Praise him in the house. So she went and we are telling boys finish eat and go to bed. She take her time and and she lay down and she uncovered the man's foot then. And that was not a sexual attempt. God help him if I saw a woman. Mm -hmm. We have today. Mm -hmm. The is coming. But she was in an act of submission. Yes. Somebody glorify God. Amen. She had something to be accomplished. Yes. Holy Spirit of Almighty God. So she obeyed the command of the woman of God. Yes. Blessed be the name of Jesus. When Boaz turned in the night, he realized that somebody was under the cover of his feet. When he turned around, it was a woman. Mm. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. He said, who art thou? He said, I'm Ruth, thine handmaid. Spread therefore thy skirt over thy handmaid. For thou art the nearest king's man. In other words, marry me. Marry me. But Boaz was so honest, Boaz said, listen, there's a nearest king's man than I am. If him not do it, I will do it. Blessed are the name of Jesus. Blessed are the name of the Lord. He could have pushed himself on her. So the story is showing some former, some former character that God gets glory from. A man is honest and a woman is in humble submission. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Praise the name of the Lord. Somebody praise God. Some boys, some girls, you never follow up for one young man. A lot of, a lot of women would have got my husband already. But a certain kind of man they want. One with straight, so. Well talking. And in pocket broke like what? <laughs> Sometimes God will want to give you an older man in your life. We mash up convention. God wants to give you an older man to protect you. To take care of you. Make sure you're not hungry. Amen. Bless the name of Jesus. Somebody praise God. I don't realize the church. Uh, you, might not, you, 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 you will not, for me, for my ministry, you're not going to like this part of my ministry because I love to teach the church and make a foundation. When you jump later on, you learn, you must learn from solid ground. Amen. Amen. Bless the name of Jesus. So all of that was done. Ruth was empowered by the instructions from the homie. Yes. And God blessed her. You know who she became? She was a great, great grandmother for King David. Yes. Yes. Where Jesus came from the lineage. Yes. Blessed be the name of Jesus. 
Praise God in the house. Praise God in the house. But for Ruth to become what she became, she had was to go on the threshing floor. Not just women, spiritually, men and women, we must get on the threshing floor of God Almighty. Because there are some things in us that needs to be beaten out. Hallelujah to the name of Jesus. We are in the house of God. We still have marriage keepers. And the preacher of home. We still have bad mind people. We still have disobedient people. We still have dishonest people. We need to get on the threshing floor of the Almighty God. Somebody praise God in the house. Yeah, we want to be empowered. The empowerment come from the threshing floor. Yes. Mighty God. My God. Hallelujah. To impact this world, we have to be the man and the woman that God wants us to be. Amen. To impact our families, we must be examples in our houses. I know we come for a mighty show tonight, but we can still shout. Yes. To impact your unsaved husband, your life must tell the story. Yes. To impact your co-workers, you must be an example. You have to get on the fresh and floor of the Almighty God. The world Prosperity. Soon get it. Are we soon done? 
Oh, you have no hope to get up in my bus. The Lord would have sent me here to remind us of who He is, who we are supposed to be. I don't, I, I'm not talking about you, but back home in our churches, there we have some people have convention spirit. In a convention, oh, how are you? And convention over, clearance. You can't find them. But that now I'm up here, I'm up here, so. When convention, then everybody come out of us. You can't be convention Christian. You must be Christian with no convention market. Christian not the morning and Christian not the evening. Christian from the job. Christian at Christmas and Christmas at Easter. You must be Christian all year round. Church, if rain fall, tell it, it fall, and the ones a convention, they might put on boots and your umbrella yes. and wear cloak, and then I come a convention. Yes. And when convention up next speak and it's sun hot like fire, yes. you yes. know, see them bishop. Yes. You know, I don't want yes, to say, yes. yes. they be like this, and they can't come down. You can't come down. Yes. You can't come down. You're so come out. This is my church. Yes. You can't come down. You see, I'm coming from way back then, old time church. And I said, I can comfortable with the microwave of Christianity. When they pop, 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 pop. Me used to the Christianity, we have to put on the pop for morning. And you are the big old cock. He can't even cook. They put all that rust in your knife to make you cook. That's where we have come from. Bless them in the name of Jesus. Man, no pop up Christian, a family come from. I'm coming up on the north side of the mountain. I'm doing somebody show the house. Doesn't matter which part of the Cayman, Jamaica, anywhere you are the England, if you are Christian, you are Christian. We don't have no Cayman Christian, if you are Jamaican Christian, if you are English Christian, and United States Christian, we are Christian right across the world. Blessed be the name of Jesus. And you can't have sin in your life and need to empower and want God to empower you. You have to get rid of that. Let the hand and praise God. Come on, give him glory, give him glory. 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 Give him glory. Give him glory. One of the reasons why some persons are not empowered is because you're living your life on what people say. I speak thus at God. Yeah. Some people have labeled you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> they find the best printer yes. and the prince of labels and they label you. They label you no good. They label you prostitute. They label you curse. The label you forgotten. The label you forsaken. Uh, all right, you're not still there. Now preach it. Bless the name of Jesus. But I want to let you know it's not what I look like on the outside. Holy Spirit of Almighty God. I heard one some writer says um, that this robe of flesh you don't even know the old time song this robe of flesh shall drop and rise to seize the everlasting price I'm gonna shout 
while passing through this year. Fear why to criticize us. Fear why to backbite us. Fear why to people that we very good. Fear why to hurt you. Fear why to sorrow. Fear why to pain. Fear why to suffering. Somebody shout the prayer. It's not what, it's not who you was, it's who you are right now. Tear up the label. The label has no self esteem. The label has now come out to nothing. Tear them out in a Jesus name. The label has poverty. The label has can't get better. The label has always crying. Tear them out. Jesus. Oh, God Almighty, somebody tell the praise in the house. Somebody tell the praise in the house. Tell the praise in the house. Some people label you, so you shall not get a house. Tear off the label. The label is your house now I'm done. Tear me off. Silently, through his brother. 
Tell your neighbor, say, you want you to prosper. Come on. Tell your neighbor, I want you to prosper. I want you to have much more than what I have. Somebody shout in the house now. Shout in the house of people. Shout in the house. Shout in the house. professional in the church. Everybody can I wash clothes and clean house. Bless them in the name of Jesus. We want some administrative people in the office right here. Bless them in the name of the Lord. So tear up the label. The old mentality. You have to do it like you mean it. Tear them off. We have played with them, but tear them off. Crumble them up and tear them up and stamp them. And throw them out. You are the one you You didn't, you didn't do bad to get in there. But you got in there. But the Lord come to release it tonight. And while you are in your jailhouse, you must know how to sing praises to the Almighty God. But the Bible says at midnight, Paul and Silas start to sing. What a friend we have in Jesus! Yes, sir, yes, sir, yes, sir. All of us sins. I wish I had more to say. At midnight, let the church say midnight. That's when you are empowered. When you are empowered, man, at midnight, when the crisis get hot, when the tribulation get very, very hot, when the suffering heated, at midnight. What's God tonight? Jailbreak in this house. Holy Spirit of Almighty God. There's a, a jailbreak. 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 If you are free tonight, you're going to shout in this house. You're out of your prison. I'm out of the bondage.
Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Somebody show Gloria your hopes.